back to my channel. So today I'm doing a Zaffle haul. So for those of you who don't know what Zaffle is, it is an online uh, website. And I think they're most commonly known or popular for their swimsuits or swimwear. Um, and the reason why they are so, so popular or have grown so much in popularity over the last couple years is because their stuff is ridiculously cheap. Uh, so what I mean by that is like all of these swimsuits that I'm going to be showing you today were all between eight to twenty dollars um, Canadian. I'm not too sure how much that is in American. I know it's a little more than that. Um, but yeah, they're so cheap. Um, so I'm just going to be showing you what they look like. I will admit that not all of these are brand new. I have, these are, I think there's maybe about 10 of them, maybe a bit more. Um, and I've gathered these over the last couple of years, but um, I did double check to make sure that all of these were still on their website and they are. So none of these still have their tags on uh, because not they're, they're not new. Um, but I have only worn them a handful of times, if even that. Um, and maybe it's a good thing that I've actually had the chance to wear them and try them out because I can also talk about the quality of them. Uh, but yeah, let's just jump right into it. All right, so this is the first swimsuit. Um, it's a bon bandeau. Uh, this one did not come with any straps, but it does have padding. Um, and the bottoms are a bit more high-waisted, so this is what it looks like. Um, I believe this one was about $13. Um, I'm personally not a huge fan of it. I, I mean, these are all size small, by the way. Uh, it is nice, and I think it probably looks really great on other people, but I find that with my body shape, it's just, it, it doesn't suit me very well, and I find that the bottoms, I don't know if it's the fit or just like how they're um, sewn because they are like double layered so they're quite thick. I just find that it kind of looks like I'm wearing a diaper. <laughs> um, but whatever, I mean, like I said, it was $13. Um, and I have worn this top a couple times just for like tanning or whatnot. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. Hey. So this is the second swimsuit. This is actually probably one of the ones I've worn the most. Um, I wouldn't say that I love it. The reason why I've worn it so much is because it, the bottoms kind of fit. And while the top is a bit loose for me, um, it is good for like tanning because it's a simple cut. But this is what it looks like. Um, and the other issue I have with this one is that it came with padding inside, but the, it was removable. Uh, but that is some an issue that I have with Zaffle padding is that it's kind of weird sometimes, like very pointy or just, I don't know, chunky in areas where it shouldn't be, uh, where it almost just looks too fake and I, I'm not a fan of that. But the nice thing is that they are removable. So if you really wanted to, you could put your own padding in it or just not have any, which is what I've opted for. Um, but yeah, oh, it's a pretty nice swimsuit. Um, it's marble, which is nice. That's kind of in right now. So yeah. Okay. So this is swimsuit number three. Uh, this is probably my favorite one of all of them or one of my favorites and that is because it fits me really well. The bottoms fit, uh, they're not too tight or too loose and the top is perfect um, and I think the colors are really pretty too. So I have gotten a lot of wear out of this. I've worn it to Bali in a waterfall, I've worn it in pools and beaches and just oh and snorkeling and it's I don't know I find that the quality is really good. There is no padding however so um, for someone like me who is kind of smaller up there, it's perfect, but yeah, anyways, uh, this is what it looks like, and it does tie up at the back here, and I'll come up closer so you can see like the colors of it, uh, but yeah, no, I like this one. Suit number four. This one I saw, I, I've seen all over Pinterest, I've seen it so many times online. 
um, or this print at least. I don't know if they're exactly all from Saffle. But um, I really like the colors on it and I do think it's a pretty pattern. I think the colors are nice um, as far as quality goes. Um, I've done all sorts of things with this one as well and it is quite thicker which is nice. It does have like the double lining um, in the front which is good so it's not see-through or anything. Um, it did come with padding but this was one of those that had the really funny weirded padding so I took that out. Um, I think this one's nice. I personally don't think that my body is the my body shape is the greatest for it um, just because uh, maybe if the top if they offered like extra small that might have been nice because I think the top might just be a bit too big for me but as far as bottoms go the fit is really good um, so it looks like in the bottom it ties up in the front and uh, yeah I like it it's nice it's um, if you're looking for something cheap to like recreate this style, this is a good option, I guess. Next so suit. Um, I do have to hold this one because it, the, the um, clasp snapped. Um, this one I'm kind of really disappointed with because first off, the bottoms are like a terrible fit. They're tiny and just don't, they don't cover much, which I'm okay with. Like I don't mind that, but what I mean by like they don't cover much is that just the cut of it, like where it cuts is really low, it just rises up a lot and then the tag goes right on the lining so you can still see that even if I cut it. Um, and this one, as soon as I took it out of the packaging, it, um, it sucked because I was in Bali and I this is one of the only swimsuits I'd taken over there at the time. Uh, the straps had already snapped and this was just taking it out of the packaging. I wasn't rough with it or anything. So thankfully where I was staying, they were able to sew it back for me, which was super kind. Uh, shout out to Chandra Villas, you guys are the best. Um, but shortly after when I came home, I put this in the wash and I do normally wash my swimsuits in like the delicate setting and even then the clasp snapped off. I don't know how uh, this has never really happened to me with any other swimsuits, but whatever. Um, this was probably about eight or nine dollars, so I can't really complain. But yeah, this is gonna be going in the garbage. Anyways, moving on to the next one. All right, next swimsuit. Uh, this one was meant to be like a mix and match one. Um, I I really like the bottoms on this. I think they fit really good. The top, not so much, but I think that's due to my size. Um, again, if maybe they had extra small, this would have probably fit me a bit better because it is a bit too big and I don't have the boobs to fill it out. But uh, you can tighten it tighter because this unties and um, this one did not come with padding. Um, and there are no, oh, oh, actually, yeah. So it didn't come with padding, but there are slits, so you could put your own padding in it if you wanted to. Uh, this is what it looks like from the back and the bottoms. And for the bottoms, um, again, I really do actually like the look of them and the color, but it was not at all the color I picked out. The yellow I picked out was more of the like beige canary, light yellow, however you want to call it. And this is obviously a very bright in your face yellow, but whatever, it it works and it's cheap, so I can't really complain. This one's an all white one. Uh, these bottoms I'm actually a huge fan of and I've worn so much with not only this top, but so many different swimsuits. The reason why I like it is because as probably you know, finding white bottoms that are not see-through when you get them wet is really tough. And surprisingly, like these, these are so cheap, but they do not go see-through whatsoever. Uh, the fit is quite good. Um, as far as the top goes, again, I the only reason why I don't really like it is the fit. Again, I wish that Zaful did um, where you could buy different sizes for the tops and bottoms, but unfortunately when you buy them, you have to pick like the same size. It, it comes as a set, so you pick small, medium, or large. Um, and I think those are kind of the only ranges of sizes that they do have. So 
if I could, I would prefer an extra small on top and then small size bottoms, but this will have to do. Um, and this did come with padding, but it was also weird padding, so I took them out. Um, but yeah, no, I don't really wear this top, but I do wear the bottoms a whole lot. Uh, these are the same bottoms, and this top did come with matching bottoms, but I actually really like the bottoms it came with, so I do... They're at my friend's house at the moment because I wear them so much um, and yeah I just I, I don't have them with me right now so anyway um, this top is really great it's probably one of my favorites because it fits good the straps are actually adjustable which is really nice um, and for someone like me who doesn't really have much going on up top it actually makes it look like you have something so I really like that I also wore it to a pool party in Vegas and I got so many compliments on it and people couldn't believe that this was like a $15 set so um, this one comes in so many different colors too and I really recommend it and I definitely will be buying more colors in the future because I think the fit is really nice but yeah um, yeah, I don't know about this one. Um, in all honesty, I haven't really worn it out. Um, yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. It's it's nice, but it's just it's not practical in any way because like I don't know that you can't you can't move your arms. You basically just always have to have like your shoulders back to hold it in place, which is kind of annoying. Um, and then. I also don't like, this is where you can kind of tell that it's a bit cheaper because looking at it up close, it just, it um, folds in odd places and then you can really, like you can see the lining very well um, on the sleeves and over here. Um, and I mean, it's placed quite well and I'm not like moving around right now, so it's fine. But as soon as you kind of start moving or whatever, you, I find that I'm constantly fixing it which is annoying, uh, but it's cheap, so I can't really complain. This one did come with padding as well. It didn't look very nice on me, so I took them out. Um, this is what it looks like from the back. Don't really want to show the bottoms, but um, the bottoms are quite teeny and they go right up my butt. Um, but whatever, mark it, honey. I think I've been watching too much Queer Eye, but I strongly recommend that show. It's so good, just full of positivity, and I like it. Anyway, uh, yeah, this swimsuit, not a fan. I, I don't really recommend getting it, but hey, it might look really great on you if you, I don't know, if you need a swimsuit to look nice and you're going to a special occasion and you don't think you're going to be moving around very much, then this might be a good option for you. Okay, so this is the next one. Um, I didn't know how I felt about this one in the beginning, but I actually, I really like it. Uh, this is one of the ones I probably wear the most. Um, I like the color and the padding actually fits well too. Well, I don't have it in a good position right now, but whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, but yeah, like the bottoms fit nicely, um, even with the, the uh, cutouts or whatever. Um, the back, that's probably the only issue I have because if I'm standing like normal the straps can be a bit um, loose um, but the bottoms fit good and I think all over it's actually a pretty nice swimsuit for for how much I paid for it. I'm pretty sure this one was one of the cheapest ones at the time. It did come in different colors too. So yeah, Sapple, you win on this one. So this is one of the only white pieces I have uh, for Zappel. I, I love the print on this one. I love the way it's designed, like the, uh, the little cutouts down the middle. And um, it's supposed to well, it crisscrosses and then it ties up over, ties up over at the back. Um, so I love the idea of it, but I'm not a big fan because well, for one, the strings are extremely long and you can, you can like tie it, bow tie it or whatever so many, over and over again to make them shorter, but that does get kind of a bit, I don't know, bunches up in the back. And I know I can cut them, um, 
and I probably should and I probably will but the reason why I don't like it is because the top is kind of off center like I feel like it should be wider on the sides you know but it's actually very narrow and like for me it's okay because I am quite petite but even then I feel like this side is um, larger than this side too and it just sits very I don't know I just I find that it sits very weirdly and the sides are like very open um, so yeah, I don't know, but for, for a one piece with this kind of cut and pattern, I'd say that like the $18 I paid for it is really not that bad. Um, and I have worn it quite a few times and I still get quite a few compliments on it. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's, would I buy it again? Probably not. But again, for $18, you can't really go wrong. Okay, uh, this is the second last one. Sorry guys, it's been so, I feel like this is long, but I have so many of the swimsuits, so bear with me. Um, this one is quite nice. I don't like the bottoms because these are like the yellow bottoms um, from earlier where the cut is just really weird and it like, ugh, I can't really show you the bottoms. This camera's too high, but it like, the way it folds is just, um, you can see the white outline, I mean, like, you can't really tell from the way, or from the camera, but like, yeah, you can see the white outline, and you can see the tag also sits, like, right on the, um, the fold, or however you call it, and even if I've cut it out, you can still see the, where it's been cut, um, but the top is really nice, I've, worn this for quite a few photos. I can't say I've worn this like to, to go swimming or anything because it's again not like very practical with the sleeves but it does sit quite nicely. The string is nice. It ties up in the back or actually I'm not really sure how you're supposed to tie it but this is the way I like it. Um, and it did also come with padding but this was really funny padding because you could like it just it looked really weird in the center so I took them out but you could put your own in. Um, but yeah. Okay, hey, last and final one. And this one is actually my favorite of them all. Um, so it's a one piece and it ties up at the top. Um, you can tie it yourself and it unties. So you can make it as tight as you want. Um, it's one of those that has like the under food cutout, which I really like. It also comes with padding, which is nice. Um, the padding is kind of bunched up right now, but whatever, I didn't feel like fixing it. Um, but yeah, it fits me really nicely. I've worn this for multiple um, swimming activities, like snorkeling and stuff. The bottoms fit well. And this was, I think, $15. It also came in different colors. So I'm a huge fan. I think it looks really pretty. And uh, for like a one piece, it's different and it's unique. And yeah, I like it. All right, so Zaffle all around. Um, I, I do recommend them. Um, I know that a lot of them I was kind of saying I didn't like or the fit I didn't like and that's just down to the fact that like you can only order one size for the sets and I am like a different size on the top and the bottoms but most of the time it does work and I'm not gonna lie I am going to order more swimsuits from them in the future I know I'm definitely gonna get some for Thailand because they are cheap and like swimsuits are not they're, they're expensive and um, it's nice to have variety, but I also don't want to spend like $100 on each of them. So this is a nice alternative. Um, as far as quality goes, it's only happened once where the swimsuit, like out of all of them that I have, the yellow one is the only one that has snapped. Um, so honestly, out of like, I don't know how many that was, but that's actually fairly good. Um, and they, the quality is quite good. Like none of them are, are see-through. Um, they all do come with padding, even if it's a bit, or most of them come with padding, even if um, they're kind of weird. You do have those cuts that you can insert your own padding in, which is quite nice. Um, but yeah, so Zaffel, I do recommend them. They're cheap. Um, <laughs> when it comes to shipping though, I don't know if this is only like a Canadian or a North American thing, but it does take a really long time to get them. 
So if you're planning on going somewhere or you need them for something, um, order them very ahead of time because it's not uncommon for them to take at least three weeks to come. Um, and their customer service is a little weird too. Um, I remember the first, first order I ever made, um, they sent me an email saying that all of the styles I'd chosen were on back order and I wouldn't really be receiving them for a few months and then two days later they showed up. So like, I, I don't really know what was up with that. Maybe it's just good service, I don't know. I don't know what happened there, but either way, yeah, I do recommend Zaful. Um, order ahead of time. Um, and pay attention to the sizing guide that they have on the website. And they also actually have like on their app or even the website, but I find the app has more pictures. There are reviews where people post pictures. So it's a good way to get an idea of what it might look like on different body types, um, which I found very useful. Um, but yeah, no, order, order swimsuits if you want and um, let me know how it goes for you. Let me know what your experience with Zappo is. And uh, I do have another haul coming up. Um, hopefully you like these sorts of videos. Uh, and the next one will be on Misguided and I'm really excited to get my order. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you guys soon with another video. All right, thanks, bye.